BTS Jimin and V's fan base united to raise funds for the relief activities of the Beirut explosion. Last week, the world was left in shock when a massive blast took place in the Lebanese capital. After the explosion, Beirut governor said that more than 300 people became temporarily homeless and about 200 people died. BTSB's international fan base B Union took this tragedy to Twitter and announced that they have donated to multiple organizations and individuals that reliable help those affected by the tragedy under B's name. Alongside with B's fan base, Jimin's fans also donated towards Lebanon Red Cross to help people impacted by the explosions. Additionally, Jimin's fan club Aden Leo announced that they've donated towards the relief aid to Korean floods under Jimin's name to help people suffering from damages that occurred by the heavy downpours. Meanwhile, a trailer of the boys' new movie Break the Silence the Movie Persona and a new teaser for the BTS Universe Story video game were released. Previously, BK Entertainment announced that BTS would be releasing their fourth film in September, and the movie will feature on stage and off-stage footage from BTS's Love Yourself, Speak Yourself World Tour. In the new trailer, Jimin says, I think I can say that they're the people with whom I am spending the most precious, brightest, and happiest moments of my life. And V says, I think it became a turning point for my attitude toward myself. And a new teaser of the BTS-themed new video game BTS Universe Story has unveiled. It's a follow-up to its previous BTS mobile game BTS World, and this time they've planned a new project to explore the universe of BTS, and the main storyline of the game will be based on BTS's Hwayang Yana series. This video game will be similar to Sims, where users can carry out missions without following a specific order to offer comfortable and free experiences to players. The Marvel, the company in charge of the development of BTS Universe Story, is founded by Pang Xiaox's cousin Pang Junyeok, and he's the second biggest shareholder of Big Hit Entertainment with 25% stake. The game will premiere in September. Despite the cancellation of BTS's world tour and other activities due to COVID-19, they can manage to achieve strong in sales thanks to BTS and its virtual live concert, Bang Bang Punta Live. Big Hit Entertainment announced Thursday that its estimated sales revenue during the first half of 2020 scored a 27% jump in half-year profit of around $42 million, and this came from its revenue of $244.8 million. BTS will come back to the stage with its new single, Dynamite, on August 21st. This was Sumiyu from Korea Now.